Hi everyone, welcome back to another Detox Box unboxing. For this month, I'm really impressed with what we've got because the products that we've got from the Ethical Beauty brand is a brand that I've been wanting to try for a while. I've uh, watched uh, other videos like featuring the products and they said that they really recommend it and then I, it's definitely one of the products that has uh, like you could say pretty packaging like it's it looks really elegant the ethical beauty brand that was featured this month was pie skincare as you can see the packaging is like this frosted glass type of container and it just looks really nice so the first product that i got is the light work rosehip fruit extract cleansing oil and um, i could i would say that the scent of this if you've ever uh you know from whole foods the juice that's titled uh, Citrus Refresh. It has a really citrusy ginger scent and I really like it and it's really subtle and natural so that's what I really like about it. Um, for all the products I would say that the scent is really nice. Um, for, for me anyways only one I didn't really like but I'll get to that later but first this is uh, what we got. Um, the light work is this it? Let me see. Yeah uh it's 49 dollars and stay golden this gentle cleanser relies on a conditioning blend of oils rosehip olive and sunflower to dissolve every trace of makeup spf and dirt revealing a fresh balanced complexion so yeah and i would say that the uh texture of it is really liquidy and i have used it uh, quite a few times and so far i really like it then we've got their all becomes clear rebalance uh, blemish serum yeah it's a little bit on the thicker side when it comes to consistency like it's not that liquidy but it's not really that uh, creamy either and this one has kind of like a pine and cinnamon scent and it mainly reminds me of autumn and I really like it all becomes clear $69 masking getting you down find clarity with this purifying serum a powerful yet delicate blend of zinc and Kapaiba eases and the look of breakouts and ba banishes excess oil in its tracks. Sans dryness or tightness. Yeah, so this one usually uh, I wear after I cleanse with the cleanser and it's, I really like, uh, all I can say is that this is really hydrating and I really like the scent of it. Then we have the System D Calm uh, Eye Serum and this feels really, really, really cooling under the eyes. And that's it's like it's really comforting type of cooling and I really like it basically unscented It's more of like a clear uh, uh, Color while the serum is kind of like more of a whitish creamy color, but this one's that and it says uh, System D eye serum $59 like a cold glass of water for dull puffy under eyes this plumping serum locks in moisture thanks to an omega rich ceramide complex well, powerhouse antioxidants, Shisandra uh, boosts skin's resilience. Lastly, we've got the Rosehip Bio Regenerate Facial Oil. And this one, uh, I've used it a few times and uh, it kind of has a scent of like a really sweet salad ranch. I really wasn't a big fan of it, but uh, I probably would still use it because it's really nourishing. Rosehip Bio Regenerate, $29. Sometimes less is more. Starring rose hip seed oil and extract, this multitasking glow giving face oil is the brand's bestseller for a reason. It instantly it instantly soothes and softens the look of skin for radiant results. So that is that. And yes, I would definitely say that it's really hydrating and nourishing on the skin. Um, but it would be a good idea um, after it completely soaks in your skin to wear like a moisturizer. At least my skin feels like it needs more hydration after it really soaks in my skin. And I would say that it doesn't really make your face look oily at all uh, from what I've, uh, from the times that I've used it, it really didn't make my skin look oily. I'm just gonna put some on my hands. It has a really pigmented orange color. Well, and it's really liquidy. <laughs> whether it leave, left my skin with like a natural glow or whether you think it's like a bit oily, um, I'll just let you decide on that. 
but I think it also depends on the amount of oil that you put on your skin so that's how much um, you know for these products like I always say a little bit goes a long way so that's why I was able I didn't put as much that's why I was able to kind of get kind of like that glow on my skin instead of having it look really oily and it does leave my skin um, feeling really dewy and nourished as well so it probably uh, takes a while for it to sink in your skin so you're uh, you're gonna feel like your face is really hydrated and won't need to apply any like cream hydrators for hours after you apply this uh, facial oil so far I've really been enjoying using this ethical beauty brand and their facial cleansers and yeah I'm really glad that it was featured for this month's detox box and I'm impressed with what I've got so far so just as a recap like for the first month I've got Evolve hair products which I love then for February we got Henne which is like it was for all about the lips detoxifying exfoliating and giving them a bit of a tint while keeping them healthy and then for March we got Pi skincare and yeah so I'm definitely going to continue to subscribe to the detox box if you're new here uh, remember to like and comment which product was your favorite and thank you for watching